Probably 35 to 40 years ago, I was studying for medicine. I was in the States, and I was majoring in the sciences that we all had to do for pre-med, and minoring in IT and writing software. My idea was that I wanted to apply IT to medicine. And of course, you see that that's now you know, very, very commonplace. So it's quite feasible now to have um, telemedicine occurring in the home that enables you as a patient to be more responsible and more involved with your own care, but in a way that can be monitored. So it's taken all this time, over 40 years, from my idea uh, and what I wanted to be involved in to what's occurred. So uh, I came to New Zealand, eventually ended up starting a business, consulting in IT and working for some of the major vendors and uh, ultimately then had the opportunity to establish Simple about 20 years ago. Simple is an IT company. We're really a systems integrator. And that means we're very, very good at putting things together. Our main purpose is to enhance lives, provide integration platforms and connectivity that enables enterprises to exchange information to better serve together their common customer, especially in health where we have the Health Exchange, which provides a platform that enables you know, all the people who participate in your healthcare, both in the setting of a hospital or a GP practice, but also in the home and in the community, to begin to share information to provide you with better health services at much lower cost. So what we do is provide technology that's very affordable, that's incremental, it's plug and play, so people can join on when they have the business case, when they're ready. I think, you know, we're very, very excited that we can make such a major difference to health. It's probably one of the biggest problems that we have, that the world has, is affordable health care. We're here to find people who want to do amazing things and then help them achieve their vision. We're just a bunch of good folk that want to do really good things with other good folk.